Hello, it's Yuris and welcome to Tattoo Shop Talk and today we will take a look at cartridges by Elite Tattoo. It's their infinity line of cartridges. I already said what I think about these cartridges on a video where I did like sort of overview on what cartridges we do use in the shop. And these were my favorite and sort of best bang for a buck because they are very budget friendly. And then company saw the video and they were happy about it. They reached out and then they sent me a bunch of more needles so I can make a dedicated video on their needles. And also we agreed and now we have affiliate program running with them which is cool that way you can get a little discount if you use our links and codes and you support the channel and it's not only the situation we get more income and then we can use that income on other products that i can buy and review on this channel for example this adapter for dan cubans machine so you can run it with battery and this will be review in the next video with that you support you not only make me a rich man and I can feed my kids and buy them shoes, I can also buy some products to review and I can support people who sell those products. And for those who are already using our discount codes and links, thank you very much. This is Infinity Line and these are these cool looking green color cartridges. There we go. And right away, just looking at them, you can tell that there's some color coding. For example, buck pin liners have this color and magnums have this color on the back of cartridges. And that is always a welcome thing. When you work on your station, you can see the unpacked cartridges, that these are that type and that's a different type. So color coding, thumbs up. They are pretty tight. They don't vibrate. They have the skinny tip. If we go on their webpage, they cost around 20 US. So depending on grouping, they are a bit more and start at 18.9. But we have a great selection here. So they have needle sizes in, in 0.2 millimeters, 0 0.25, 0 0.3 and 0.35. And then they have a bunch of groupings and there are like, there are bug pins, there are extra tight round liners, regular liners, medium tight liners, turbo liners. And they also have a different tapers of the needles, which is also cool. So you can get some long taper or medium taper needles. First of all, if you know what's up, you have them. If you don't, for example, you can try some medium taper for coloring in and see if it works for you better or not. Now I'm looking at these needles on Elite Tattoo webpage. We buy them locally because it's just easier. It's more convenient. We buy from our supplier. They're great needles. These prices and variations I'm talking from EliteTattoo.com so have a look and also check what's the shipping options to your country because you don't want to support the channel and then end up paying a lot of import fees and stuff like that but that you can reach out to the company and see how the shipping goes to your country on some web pages you see them by generations and these would be elite infinity 5 they would be the regular the shape needles and then they also have a on some web pages they go by generation 6 on some it's elite infinity plus and the difference is that they have this rubber finger rest thing which feels nice in the hand they don't have them on elite tattoo web page but I just want to inform you that that option is out there. It feels nicer in the hand, but it takes way more space. Box of 10, you see it's almost twice the size. And that's why I prefer these, because they take less space in the cartridge shelf. And that's a little information for you. How I got to these needles, I didn't pay attention much to them, but my colleague Dan, he said he really loves them. I tried them and they're actually good and I never used much of a bug pin needles and again because of him he recommended and he's using them and it works fine for him I decided to try and they're actually quite good now let's say instead of five liner I would take seven bug pin and I prefer it better and I think ink flow is better so that's something to look into and they have bug pin needles up to 18 bug pin round liner I haven't used them that big but we use it regularly 11 bug pin round liner for example and then for thicker needles we use different groupings and often there would be some round shaders. A bit thicker line, seven round shader, even more thick, nine, and then we have some specialized needles. There's something interesting that I haven't tried is a turbo liner, and in the description it says it's 0.35 millimeter diameter needles, super X long taper, 5.5 millimeter solder point. Another thing that I wanted to point out, we just asked them to send our regular groupings that we use on regular basis, so that would be from three to 11 liners, most of them bug pin then some magnums and then i asked send me the biggest grouping that you have and they sent us these 35 and 39 magnums and these are these beauties that's 35 and let's open 39 i haven't had a chance to use it yet look at these my colleague did some black work type of a thing and he said it worked fine and he was very satisfied with them it's just you have to find your rhythm and maybe work a bit slower and then it's fine, but that's usually with those bigger groupings. So I guess these are no different than any others. And the option is there. Another thing to keep in mind, they come eight in a box. 
Price-wise, again, super budget-friendly. Regular needles go around 20 and a bit up per box and that would be around dollar per one needle and then if we go into chunky stuff 14.90 and 16.90 per box of eight so that sets you back two dollars per one needle which is not bad at all they're budget friendly and they work good and these are needles that we use on a regular basis in the shop and plus on prices you can get a discount i forgot about that so that's also something and if you browsing their web page there's a bunch of stuff something i would like to try in the future is the transfer paper because we know a lot of brands are coming out with new variations and the older brands doesn't seem that they stack up that good anymore but that's something i hope i'll try in the future and what i wanted to point out they have a disposable pen grips and these are for Cheyenne machines and bishop one machines and that's a very budget friendly option it's i think it's like half of the price that you would buy from original brand they have disposable grips in 34 and 48 millimeters for bishop ones this classic one is compatible with fk irons and flux machines exo pens 14 15 us and these are compatible with elite fly v3 nano v2 pens you can take a look it yourself and these should be compatible with Cheyenne pens 15 bucks for 20 pieces that's very budget friendly price now you have no excuse to go disposable if you don't have other options to sterilize because this is very budget friendly and you don't have to buy original ones now if you're shopping for cartridges you can also check that stuff out and see how it goes maybe if they will like this video maybe they'll send me some more stuff so i can hopefully try those things and there's no reason for them not to like this video i already said good stuff about them there was no freebie i hadn't i didn't have anything sent also here i don't have to say anything good or bad they just send them for review and then again it's not a secret they already knew that i like these needles so i guess it's the win-win for everyone almost forgot to mention one thing let's open the cartridge up close up there we go nice neat shape let's take it apart which is not that easy there's your membrane and let's do the alternative thing that is probably not recommended 1011 bug pin liner and let's do the magical thing whoa and that's it opened up a bit so now it's more like a shader looking thing and it still fits back in the tip there's a thing on the inside for stability the white white round thingy and this part on a cartridge would go through there and improve the stability or add stability make it more stable boom and fits back through there we go burnt 11 bug pin round liner Boom. I don't know what else to yap about needles like i like them they're good they're good price we buy them from local suppliers just because it's easier with shipping and then there's no import costs or anything like that but if you are in a country that have a good terms with this brand then check them out and if you want to support our channel use our affiliated links and discount codes and if you have any opinion on these cartridges then please let me know in the comment section and do the usual check our links in the video description press like on the video if you're super awesome then share it and check this video on all the needles that we use in the shop up here i'll see you in the future episodes as usual stay safe and i'm out bye